Oh, no. Mr. Cole. <laughs> and Dr. Collins, is it? Correct. Kevin, uh, this is Mr. Luke Spencer. I uh, told you about him, if you remember. Of course. How are you? Nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Hatching any more harebrained schemes to harass my sister? I thought we went over that. I didn't mean for any of that to happen. Ah. Mm. Have fun. Thank you. Hi, baby. Hi. I didn't think you ever came down here. I haven't seen you. Mm. I only do this when I'm looking for you. Oh. Uh, Commissioner, do you mind if I uh, borrow your wife? No, just as long as you bring her back alive. <laughs> Neighborly, <laughs> darling. Let's go over to the bar. Yeah. yeah. I need some help. Anything, darling. Really? Yeah. Okay. There's a council man named Blake. Mm -hmm. City council. I'd really love to take a look at some of his uh, tax returns for the last few years. Now, an ordinary Lord Wyden citizen like myself can do that, but I have to yeah, go through all these Yeah, but of course, somebody with a press, you know, could probably just mm, right on Bingo, yeah, bingo, exactly. bingo, bingo. Great minds in sync here, great minds. Will you do it? Sure. Just tell me why you want me to do it. I'm checking his arithmetic. <gasps> I see. Thank you, gorgeous. Anything, darling, I'll do anything for you. Really? Yes. How about you uh, dump Donnelly and have a wild, steamy affair with the happening right now? Ooh, don't tempt me. <laughs> I'll let you know when I have something, okay? Hi. Hi, can I get you something? Yeah, scotch, rocks. Coming up. Looks like your joints jumping tonight. Yeah, Miguel Mordez. You remember him? He sang at the nurse's ball? Oh, yeah. He's decent. No, it's better than that. Decent as praise. Stick around for the show. Maybe I will. How's Maxie? Terrific. If we hadn't gone through it, there's no way to know she'd been sick. Well, that's good. I'm glad to hear that, Mike. Enjoy. Hey, cheers. This looks like a table full of high spirits. Oh. There he is. Uh, Luke, meet my friend, Lois. Hey, nice to meet you. My pleasure. It's a very high-spirited table. Our new singer debuts his band tonight. Yeah, I heard something about that. Congratulations on your new gig. Thanks, man. You're looking at the new Sonny Corinthos, Mr. Legit, man. <laughs> Are you going to stay for the show? I wouldn't miss it. Good. Are you saying you can't be friends? Dad, you don't know how to be anyone's friend. You know, every miserable thing that's happened in the last few months has been indirectly or directly because of you, including and up to the fact that I lost deception because of that walking nightmare over there. Well, I had nothing to do with it. Right. Well, if that's the way you treat your friends, count me out. Now, I'm going to do something I don't really do. I am going to be as deadly honest with you as I possibly can. I don't want to play games with you anymore. I have a new person in my life, and he has this big diploma on his wall. This degree says he's in the business to be nice to people and help them, not Who hurt them. Who are you trying to fool? You're going to be bored silly within two weeks. No, I'm not. Yes, you will. No, I'm not. I will. I will not. Kevin is anything but boring. Now, do not let the door hit you. Go. Good night, Lucy. Mm -hmm. Well, she's all yours, pal. Get her while she's hot. Hey, you watch your mouth about her. Unless you think you haven't already bought enough trouble for yourself in this town. My, my, and who was it that prematurely pronounced chivalry dead? Smarmy little weasel, isn't he? Trust there'll be no Spanish dancing tonight. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> Not until I meet your lovely companion. Do you attack any pregnant women today? My name is Catherine Ashton, and your wife was hardly my victim. She was on ELQ property without permission with the intention of causing a disturbance. Her intention was a peaceful demonstration, and it worked. You know, the incinerator was my idea. Catherine was simply performing a service she was hired for. So if you have any problems, you address them to me. Keep your eye on the mail. Yeah. Watch out for him. Make sure you keep a, an eye over your shoulder.